on the 3rd of February uh, 2013 I arrived uh, at about 10 o'clock in the morning at the Berry bus station and uh, I was picked up by Rogers TV to uh, start uh, this wonderful production of curling. Well, we started the next day, February the 4th. Sometime in the afternoon was my first show. Needs to get T line at least. They're saying top eight. That's not a good. That's not a good sign. And this might come up short. No, it's going to curl enough. Look at this shot. Oh, that's a four foot dirty miss. That is just uh, call that dirty pool. That's not the shot they called, and it's uh, probably better than than they could have hoped for. It looks like it's pretty much open though. Um, over curled. End up with T line weight. And uh, sweepers went end to end on this, and they're just trying to get it there for weight at this point. You know, I heard them say top eight. And uh, they're trying to play the tap on that yellow, miss it completely, slide right through the hole. And uh, that rock uh, ends up shot stone <laughs> kind of through a port. Mostly open. There's a good look at it. You can see, see a good chunk of it, but that is not a big port at all. And you really couldn't have slid a piece of paper in between those two yellow stones. No, that was a good break for uh, for Ferris. Having said that, I mean, you'd, you'd hate living, leaving your opponents with a shot to win the game, and that's what we're looking at here. So, you know, this is all you can ask for as a skip. You got a shot to win. You're one down coming home. You got a shot to win. Brent Ross settling in. So Brent Ross 